Yo, what's poppin'? So series points are literally the most important way to qualify for tournaments such as the FNCS or even the World Cup, whatever that comes out. And a lot of people don't even know what series points are or that series points even exist. But series points are literally the most important factor in qualifying for major tournaments. I mean, if you don't believe me, just take a look at this. In this FNCS, 102 teams with the most series points qualify to the grand finals. But only 30 teams qualify through qualifying. Fires. So I'm telling you, serious points is the most important way to qualify for these major tournaments. So I'm here to explain every single thing you need to know about serious points, including how it works, how to get more so you can qualify, and then most importantly, how to determine how many serious points you have and how many more points you need to actually qualify for those grand finals so you can win that crazy prize pool. Alright, so take a second, drop a like, subscribe, and of course use the code AutoClick in the item shop. For every person using code AutoClick in the item shop, I will do two push-ups and yo take a look at this this is so exciting we just launched a new discord server where you can win completely free skins and v bucks you can play games with me you can play customs with me you can be in my videos and so so much more so if you want to join just click that join button next to subscribe and you can be a part of our discord server and by the way if you're mobile then i'll leave a link down in the description so check that out trust me it is worth it but okay finally let's take a look at this series points and how exactly it works so here is the exact placements that you must get if you want to get serious points as you can see it goes all the way to top 10,000 teams and of course up to first place you get 500 serious points so there's a huge range of teams to get serious points and by the way yes this is in teams so if the tournament is in trios so for example this FNCS is trios then top 10,000 teams get 10 serious points or top 30,000 players get serious points and again I'll show you how many serious points you must get to qualify for the grand finals and how to know how many serious points you have so stick around for that so now this may be a little confusing so put your seatbelts on and pay attention no just kidding you'll be fine i'll give you examples and explain it the best way i can so it is not as simple as getting for example 100th place and you get 196 serious points that is not how it works at all so again with this fncs as an example there's four rounds in total and that is really important to keep in mind because your serious points only count at the last round that you can play so if you unlocked round two your serious points in round one will not count at all and for example if you unlock round three your serious points in round two and round one will not count and on and on and on so the last round that you can play that is the round your serious points will count so here let's give you an example to make this clear so for example in round one you get 150th place now you might think that you get 160 serious points well no that is not the case because as you qualified for the round two since 1500 teams qualify for round two from round one okay so you made it to round two now let's say you get 100th place in that round as well and of course you guess it you do not get that 196 series points because again you managed to qualify for the round three so now okay in that round three let's say you get 150th place and by getting that unfortunately you do not qualify for the round four so that round three is the last round that you can play meaning that you will get those 160 series points so i hope that wasn't too confusing and by the way since there's three qualifiers that means that you can get serious points in each qualifier so from each qualifier week you are able to get serious points each time and yes those do add up together to determine whether or not you actually qualify for the grand finals and again i'll show you how many points you actually need to do that but now super quick let's take a look at how to actually get more serious points so the first and most obvious thing is that you should play every single qualifier week there is. In this case, since there's three qualifiers, you should play every single one of them. No matter if you get 10,000th place, you still get serious points. And again, those do add up to your ultimate score. So being consistent and playing every single qualifier there is, is so, so important. Now, one of the most important things to keep in mind is that you must play with the same trio in each qualifier. If you switch trios, then your serious points completely reset to zero. So if you did switch trios this FNCS, and just make sure not to do that in the next upcoming FNCS and other tournaments that include serious points. Alright, so make sure every single player in your team, it doesn't matter if it's duos, trios, or squads, make sure that they all can play all the qualifiers. Again, consistency is the most important factor in qualifying for these major tournament grand finals. So now before we take a look at how many serious points you actually need to qualify for the grand finals, this is the last and one of the most important 
tricks I can give you to get more serious points. And that is just not giving up no matter what happens. I see so, so many people rage and completely quit a tournament because they're not doing well. Again, as I mentioned like 10 times already, consistency is the most important thing that you must realize. If you're not doing well at all, that is completely fine. You're very likely to get that 10,000th place. And those 10 serious points can literally qualify you for the grand finals. So trust me, play every single tournament and do not rage quit. There is always still a chance. But okay, this is how you determine how many points you currently have and how many points you need to actually qualify for those grand finals. So you can win a part of that insane prize pool. So first, to determine how many points you currently have, you can simply go to the Fortnite tracker and look your name up. So for example, I play the qualifier 2 and I place 4338th. Yo listen, my team crashed 3 times, okay? Don't roast me. But since I got 4,338th place, as you can see on this chart, we can see that we fall between this range right here. Meaning we got 16 serious points. Oh my god, dude, that is sad. So you're gonna keep doing this for however many qualifiers you played. I only played the qualifier 2. I did not play the week 1 qualifiers. But if you did, then add that as well. So 16 plus 0, unfortunately for me, would equal, well, 16. Quick maths. So then, since we know how many serious points we currently have, we can go to this discord right here and see how many more points we need to actually qualify by the way remember to join my discord link down in the description but in this discord all you have to do is simply type dollar sign serious points then type in your region and how many serious points you currently have so again for me it is 16 and you click enter so then you're gonna get a dm saying exactly what place you must get to still qualify for those finals so as you can see they say the estimate for NA east was 445 serious points in total to move on to those grand finals. A safer number is around 475 points. So since I only have 16 points, I would need to get around 452 points in that week 3. And again, this applies to every single tournament that is coming up with serious points. It's not just about this FNCS. I'm just using this as an example. So if you actually want to qualify, I would need to get top 3 during the week 3. And again, going back to this chart, this makes sense. And by the way, no, you do not have to split your serious points with your trio somehow. These serious points apply to every single member on your trio. Of course, as long as you stay together as a team. So yeah, this tool is absolutely amazing if you want to see if you have a chance of actually qualifying for those grand finals. And again, as I mentioned, top 102 teams qualify through serious points and only 30 teams qualify through the weak qualifiers. So focusing on serious points and understanding how they work is absolutely crucial. And of course in case this serious points format changes, I'll make a video instantly on that. So of course if any tournament comes out that does have serious points, I will make sure to cover that instantly. So that is why you should be subscribed right now. And of course drop a like if this video did help you guys out. By the way, remember code autoclick in the app shop and most importantly make sure to join that discord server you can literally get free v bucks and skins you can play games with me we can play arena and just chill and you can even be in my videos so make sure to join that instantly now yes it is 7.99 but again you can literally win completely free v bucks and skins so you can easily get that back and much much more but all right boys that is going to be the end of this video thank you all so much for watching peace out and bye bye